Hello everyone, welcome back again with me on 3rd Konyago channel. Today in this video, I will show you how to analyze a spanner. We will know the breakpoint the spanner. Without wasting time, let's start it. First step, active SOLIDWORKS simulation. Go to SOLIDWORKS add-ins. Click SOLIDWORKS simulation. Go to simulation. Click new study. We choose static analysis and make name project is static analytics panel okay we use material cast alloy steel insert a fixture active figuometry Make this face for fig geometry parameter. Okay. Now we insert a force. Go to external load, click force. Click this face. Click selected direction. To stop them for reference. Click this parameter, check reference direction, make full loop the force is 100 Newton. Ok. Now we make a mess. Go to mess, click create MS. Check mess parameter, we choose standard mess. Ok. Wait until dawn. After messing down, click around the simulation. After simulation down, go to stress. Create the definition. Change unit to MPA. Click through scale. Go to chart option. Check show max annotation. Change to floating. Okay. See? The value of maximum stress is 103.84 MPA. The value is still below the year strength value and can be said to be safe. And the break point is this area. Let's see the deepest man. Go to edit definition Click through scale Go to chart option Check show max annotation Change to floating Make 2 after the comma Ok See, the flow of maximum displacement is 0.7mm the value is quite small. Now I want to see factor of safety the spanner. Go to result. Click define factor of safety plot. Choose all. Next, multiply factor is 1. Next, see, minimum factor of safety is 2.3. Ok. Go to setting. Go to chart option. Change floating. And max value is 2 after comma. Ok. See? The minimum value is 
I think it's the end of tutorial. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.